Hey, what's going on guys? It's Robert Welkner and Andre Meadows, aka Black Nerd Comedy. We're gonna do a review. We just got out of Pacific Rim. Pacific Rim! We are canceling the apocalypse! <laughs> Today, today, today. <laughs> He's doing a line from the movie and it's in the trailer as well. So we're in the Grove Mall. We're going to walk a bit. Yeah, we're going to walk. The Grove in Los Angeles, California. Now, Beautiful. if you are subscribers to my YouTube channel, Coinet TV, you might have saw our turbo review yesterday. Yeah, yeah. So annotate, now, annotate. Now we're, doing, <laughs> now we're doing the Pacific Rim. Yes. Completely the same movie, exact same movie. <laughs> you can see either one is gonna, you're gonna get the exact same movie, I'm telling you. No, uh, yes, uh, Pacific Rim, uh, the Power Rangers movie I've been waiting for. <laughs> I would have went with Voltron, Robotech, Gundam. Different decades. Though. Uh, yes, different decades. <laughs> but I was thinking Power Rangers also. Yeah, um, I had a blast. I mean, this movie was fun. It was a lot of fun. See, like, I'm okay with dumb stuff. I'm okay with buildings falling down. I'm okay with monsters. I'm okay with crazy, stupid lines. As long as the entire movie is like that. That's what I like about this one. Like, it doesn't give me, you know, like, like certain man of superness, you know, want yes. to be all serious in one moment, but then want to, like, crash a bunch of buildings. You can't do both. Pick a side. S S S S S S stay with side. me. We're going to the sun now. Oh, yeah. Oh. S ah. Stay with me. This is a little more brighter than I than I anticipated. <laughs> I'm melting. There's movie, this. I'm dead. This is what the Grove looks like. <laughs> at all. I know Andre's trying to give a very serious review. No, no. And I'm I'm doing tourist <laughs> tourist man You're here. You're tourist. This is what tourists do. In the Grove, it's it's kind of like downtown Disney. Pinwheels over here, man. There's pinwheels. Giant pinwheels. All right, let's walk a bit. All right. Yeah, what I was think I was thinking that in my head. I was thinking, you know, I saw Man of Steel. Yeah. I saw Iron Man three, mm -hmm. and I didn't get what I wanted from those movies. Mm -hmm. But I kind of got it with Pacific Rim here. Satisfied. Satisfied action. <laughs> giant plant. A little, little bit of a yeah. We got a giant plant. <laughs> Walking around. Hey, yeah. I'm back. <laughs> this, sound, this sounded like a better idea a second ago. <laughs> Now it's kind of turned into an obstacle course. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Everyone's all freaked out. Don't film me, don't film me. We're filming ourselves. Don't worry, guys. It's all good. But yeah, I, had, I, I, gave, I gave it a big giant thumbs up. I mean, it was like, yeah. like <laughs> it was serious. It was intense. <laughs> yep. <laughs> we're avoiding <laughs> And I'm back. What's up? <laughs> I like that you're wearing like the Pac-Man Pac -Man shirt because it kind of feels like we're doing like Yes. You know, avoiding the ghosts. Pac-Man and the ghostly adventures. Let's on go Disney over in the shade. Right, we're gonna go. We're gonna get away from store. Intensive. I can't concentrate <laughs> while the sun yeah. is in my face. Yeah, it's pretty hot. It's but good. that being said, it's just hot. A specific rim, which is a great movie that you should go see. I don't, you know, this is gonna be the real review. Where are we going? I'm in a maze right now. Here we go. All right, we're going this. We're going this way now. Oh God, <laughs> I can't keep up with this. All right. So yeah, yeah. To keep. I just didn't do this. To keep. Yeah. How does, how does Olga Kane? I just didn't do this. And they make this interesting. They say fun things. But believe me, I can't say anything fun while I'm holding the camera. Yeah. yeah. It's, yeah. All right. But so, yeah, definitely. Like that's what I was thinking. I was like, this is like the the, the Robotech, the Gundam, the Power Rangers movie that I've been yeah. waiting for. You know, 20, yeah. 30 years in the making. Yes. Or if you just like seeing a bunch of stuff blow up and fight. Good stuff. Good yeah. Stuff. Uh, one. Gripe was a lot of fighting in like water and and like rain. Yeah, and that got a little like too busy on the screen. That like I was just like, hey, you know, I can't yeah. I can't get like the details of like the giant robots. And I stuff. agree with that. Like there was a fight in Hong Kong, and like it's like a future Hong Kong, so there's neon everywhere there, and so you have the So that was a nice aesthetic. Whereas yeah, the ones in the water, it's like gray, blue, black, and the monsters are gray, the suits are gray. So, yeah, it's kind of yellow. Jesus, but yeah. But still, that's a, that's a minor complaint. Well, yeah. Awesome movie. Well, because I was thinking, I was like, now if I saw this in 3D, that rain would have like really played tricks on my, my <laughs> yes. visuals and stuff. Yes. Oh, and don't expect like subtle acting in this movie. <laughs> Which I think is good. For this movie, I think it's good. I'm angry at you. I'm angry. I'm the bad guy. I just met you, but I'm so mad at you. I am the love interest. <laughs> I'm not mad at you. <laughs> you cannot fight. You cannot fight. I, we have a connection today. I just love that they started his speech like that. He's like, today, today, we are fighting the monsters. We are canceling me. <laughs> You're making me laugh. It's hard to hold this. I, 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 I like that dude, man. I loved him since. Uh, um, now, speaking since of that guy. 
Idris Elba? There was a few, yeah, some of the actors seem to have accents that started halfway through the movie. No, no, he always had the accent. Did he? Cause Did like, you miss it? The son also, he sort of started talking was, like well, as a Frenchman, you know, like no, halfway no, but through. The, yeah, he just had his accent. He had the, the accent, time. okay. never talk bad about Idris Elba. He's the greatest actor of our generation. The man is Luther, the man is the next Doctor Who, I'm calling it, and he, uh, and he was an obsessed with Beyonce Knowles. It's great okay. movie. Go see it. Obsessed. Sharon! She means nothing to me, Sharon! That's, that's it. I love that guy. All right, so Andre, overall, overall are we going to send people to see this? Pacific Rim, this is the end. The movies of the summer. Everything else, skip. Inter Inter yeah. This was like... And Despicable Me too. I mean, this is like when I left Starship Troopers, I felt the same way. I was like, action, giant... Aliens, robots, yeah. craziness. Yeah. It's what I want from a summer blockbuster. Yes. Uh, nice you know, and easy. if you're a video gamer person, we got Titanfall coming out uh, soon. Yeah. And I was kind of thinking, like, hey, this is like the Titanfall movie. You know, jump in and out of mechs, <laughs> destroy yeah. people. Yes. Where's my Pacific Rim game and and toys and everything? Cartoon series. I want I want this franchise to continue. Let's do it. All right, that's it. That's all we got. That's we got. got. You guys, let us know in the comments if yeah. you saw Pacific Rim, which thought of the movie, which thought of this vlog. Yes. yes. Make sure you check out Andre's channel. Black Nerd Comedy, go check it out. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Yes, we're cool. We're out. <laughs>